It's Monday morning, February the 15th, and it's cold and it's early. All right, so this morning we woke up to a message from eBay. Let's sit you down for a minute. Uh, so we got a message on eBay. Uh, an individual said, hey, I got this thing in the mail. Here's a picture of it. He sent me a picture of the label. Uh, I'm so-and-so. I don't know this product. I never ordered it. And um, could you shed some light? Yeah, sure. No problem. So I came down here. Uh, watching auctions today, so we got to hurry. Uh, found out that, obviously, it was very apparent that the uh, item was not listed, purchased, or shipped on eBay to this individual. This individual has been a member since 2017, hasn't had any transactions in the last 12 months. Of the three feedback that they've got on their account, two of them are from overseas, one from China, one from Hong Kong. Doesn't matter. I get it. Uh, it's weird, though, because they sell electronics. The comments on uh, those two uh, transactions are the same, identical, but two different uh, usernames, which is weird. So are they linked? I don't know. Are they copying like they copy everything else? I don't know. Uh, the third one is uh, you, a old account from 1998 from Tennessee. No longer in business. Sad. Uh, so anyway, that kind of just piled onto the red flags. We're gonna call this segment red flag, red flag, red flag. So under this message, uh, I call eBay. eBay, awesome job, thanks for the customer service. I contacted you and within a less than a minute, dude, I had Adam on the phone. Adam, you're awesome. Um, you know, and he pretty much gave me kind of like the same information as I was thinking. He suggested to um, go ahead and send a message to this individual. Um, because he's technically not a customer, but I'm going to treat this as if it was a customer, to go ahead and refer this uh, information over to the Amazon platform. Yeah, I mean, we got that part. And, and that's what we did. So basically, we did a message and said, you know, hey, sorry to hear this. Uh, hopefully, we can resolve this over on Amazon because this was not advertised, listed, or purchased under eBay. Please proceed to your Amazon account. Now, this is the bear trap right here. Because if it is a scammer, and this is what I'm thinking, okay? Let's go over here to the sidebar. Here's what I thought. Somebody might have intercepted this because in their message, they said, this eBay order. Now, there is, a, if you're a reseller, you know the difference between an eBay order and an Amazon order. That's all I'm going to say. If you know that, then you're going to know by looking at the photo that that was not an eBay order. Um... So anyway, I took that red flag, red flag, red flag, and we applied it to the message in a way that we didn't divulge too much information on our end, but we basically said, information is correct. Platform is incorrect. Please proceed forward to the next step. Thank you. Have a nice day. Whoopsta. So um, yeah, that's where we're at with that. And we're going to see what happens. And hopefully, maybe if it's a legit request... Because I can't 100% say that I think it's complete fraud. But if the individual will have or should have, if it, <clears throat> excuse me, if it is the individual uh, and they did send it over, uh, they will just go to Amazon and send a request through that process. And it's a done deal. If they don't, then somebody definitely took someone's credit information, purchased an item, and misused their credit and sent this item to uh, another location. Or somebody possibly took it from the mail service after it was delivered, because it shows that it was delivered, um, and stole it. And trying to get more information uh, from me, which I'm not going to do. So if they want a... Uh, information because he's not really requesting to return it because it really didn't happen through ebay so yeah we'll see well there you go red flag red flag red flag and uh i'll see you guys on friday seven o'clock to gringo's talk thanks for watching don't forget to hit the subscribe button y'all we're getting close we're almost at 600 subs what awesome see you guys take care